Patty Clements. I found her to be most interesting. I really enjoyed her stories about the um, DRC, and I think that she's done some incredible things in um, while she was there, and you know since she's been back working on the arms embargo. Indescribable. Diplomatic. Amazing. <laughs> um, the 
Geneva is a great city, it's a great town, it's very expensive, but uh, I think this experience is amazing because of the people that I'm with. It's actually about people and the way that people interact with each other. You have to always be ready to compromise. However, always keep in mind that um, your goal has to be primarily and your objective has to remain the same no matter how many different people and uh, basically our goal is to have a better world without a uh, small arms. After meeting all of the ambassadors and, you know, the you know people who work for NGOs and for other organizations. It's kind of interesting to me to see that you know these are just real people um, who are dedicated to this line of work and are very passionate for what they want to do. And um, you know it's obvious that, that they feel like you know what they're doing in some way is making a difference. Um, and you know even one of our guest speakers, um, Susan Walker, says that you know one person can make a huge difference. And I think that even though I may not have, that's not necessarily learning something I may not have already known, it's encouraging to see that, you know, these people are really dedicated to what they do and that they believe that they are making a difference. So, you know, it's encouraging to think that maybe, you know, in this field we can make a difference. That was when I